Afghanistan is, is actually absolutely gorgeous. I have a few very select memories of being recently finished with a gunfight and looking up at the scenery and being like, what? what? How is this happening here? Like, this is gorgeous. Just untouched terrain of beautiful cliffs and mountains. And I was just like, man, I, I can't wait to get back and, and do what I love to do, which is, is rock climbing. Even if you don't realize it when you're in the military, um, so much of the pride comes from the fact that you're doing something greater than yourself. I couldn't have left the army and then just got the corporate job. So I kind of went to the base of what I love to do. And I was like, yeah, I love to rock climb, but that's like just rock climbing for a living doesn't do anything greater. So what is something greater that we can do with this? And I was like, well, what if we opened a rock climbing gym and then use that as a tool to teach people leadership, to teach people team building. My role with Warriors Ascent is uh, the expeditions chief. So sometimes I lead guys in team building and leadership workshops. And sometimes we do uh, kind of high ropes activities. The focus is not like the physicalness of, of what you're doing. It's, it's what it represents. It's really hard for guys to, to find what's gonna help them heal. And it's not necessarily always medication and like therapy. Uh, a lot of times it's, it's finding out what your purpose in life is. For me, fortunately, I, f I figured out what my passion was and then, you know, made a goal to strive for. But in the end, it has to be so much bigger than that.